Last year, a new bright began to glide across the starry sky, China's space station. How was it made? What does it look like inside? This is Future China. In 2021, after five launches, including two crewed missions, the space station's technology was verified as safe and sound. This year, six missions will be launched for the space station. Two lab modules, Wentian and Mengtian, two cargo craft, Tianzhou 4 and Tianzhou 5, two crewed missions, Xinzhou 14 and Xinzhou 15. Later this year, Xinzhou 14 and Xinzhou 15 crew will for the first time rotate in orbit. The six astronauts will live together in the space station for five to ten days. Wentian and Mengtian will have 12 experiments cabinet. They will support China's more than a thousand in-orbit research projects, spanning space life sciences and human research, microgravity physical science, space astronomy and earth science, as well as new space technologies and applications. They will advance research in areas where no man or woman has gone before. Researchers from around the world will also be welcome to participate in these programs so that space science benefits all. Astronauts who want to enter the space station must transfer through the note cabin, which is where we head next. This is what Tianhe's note cabin looks like inside. If we enter through this door, we can see how astronauts live and work in the space station. Tianhe has different areas for work, sleep, sanitation, dining, house care, and exercise. As there is no gravity in space, you might be wondering, do astronauts just float around during sleep? How do they not bump their heads? Actually, each of them has a separate sleeping cabin equipped with a sleeping bag and a light. The sleeping bags are attached to their bedroom walls to avoid them from floating away while knocking into objects. Liquids behave very differently in space. So how does going to the bathroom work in space? How do they dispose of waste? Let's check out the bathroom and find out. The toilet has been specially developed for astronauts. It has a vacuum-operated fan, so any solids or liquids are quickly severed away and stored in an internal container. The container is emptied every 10 days and can hold the deposits of up to 30 people. The Shenzhou 13 mission was China's longest trip in the space station. The crew stayed in orbit for six months. To reduce the effects of living in the microgravity environment, they exercised quite often. Let's have a look at the space stream. There is a treadmill, spin bike, and a resistance band. Using the equipment, they can burn calories and practice strength training. Every day, they would do moderate intensity exercise which required approximately 60 to 80% of their maximum strength. This is the experiment space. The Shenzhou 13 crew give two space classes while on their mission, wowing their viewers with trials and tests. Down with the continuous experiment cabinet up here, and the high-quality microgravity experiment cabinet right here. We hope you found the immersive tour of the space station and all of this world experience. Full of stellar experiments and scientific research, 2022 is going to be an exciting year for the space station. Let's wait 